for the official inquiry after her death, is one of the world's most renowned forensic pathologists and has examined more than 23,000 dead bodies. After re-examining Diana's dead body, Dr. Richard has revealed some of the strange questions he was faced with. Both Diana, 36, and her lover Dodi Fayad, 42, were killed when their Mercedes crashed in an underpass, in the Pont de l'Alma Road Tunnel in Paris, France in August 1997. Diana died after suffering fatal injuries in the car crash. After Dr. Richard carried out a second autopsy on the late Diana's body, he was asked some odd questions about her appearance. He stated that he was inundated with questions about Princess Di's autopsy but has long refused to reveal intimate details. The Daily Mirror online reported that people questioned whether she had been pregnant or not. According to the pathologist, people asked, was she beautiful? Was she peaceful? Was she pregnant? I always made sure I never said anything, in all the cases of public interest I was involved with, that hadn't already appeared in the press. He continued, pathologically there was no evidence that Princess Diana was pregnant, but some women say they know they're pregnant from the moment of conception. Was she one of those? Dr. Richard also claimed that Diana would have been here for Prince Harry's wedding to Meghan Markle in May if she had worn her seatbelt. If she had taken this step, he believes she would have survived the tragedy with a black eye or maybe a broken arm. Instead, she was hurtling forward with the weight of one and a half elephants, and the human body is not designed to suffer those forces. Her driver, Henri Paul, was said to have been driving at twice the British speed limit, driving at about 70 mp, which is also thrice the British drink drive limit. He also died in the horrific crash. However, Trevor Rees, her bodyguard, was the only survivor with horrific injuries. However, the jury at Diana's death investigation revealed that the Diana and Dodie were unlawfully killed, and their deaths were the result of gross negligence on the part of Henri and paparazzi, who were following the vehicle on motorbikes. Accident investigator Anthony Reid said 